Hi guys, I'm JL Anderson01 and welcome back to Let's Play Resident Evil Dark Side Chronicles. I'm actually doing post commentary because uh Damn it. it's uh there's my whole recording of this was lost. I had fifteen minutes of gameplay and commentary and I got lost. Uh because my other laptop decided to be stupid and not work. It froze. I lost all the commentary that I had for this video thus far. So this is post commentary. I know, right? So here I'm showing you the different. Uh, as you see, I'm Claire instead of Steve, and I'm showing you what the difference is of what now? they said or what they're doing. So yeah, I'm Claire, and I'm, I had a lot more video, but There's I cut a lot of it out. Side. Because uh, it's just it's just easier. All right, so then I gotta go play Chapter Six after this, but I don't know if I want to because I had to turn off my little laptop because it was just I might have to do it tomorrow. Uh, this video isn't gonna be posted until later anyway. You guys aren't gonna be able you you're not knowing what I'm talking about because it already is dealt with. As you hear, it was Claire that says the line and not Steve. And then, hey guys, beautiful face to wake up in the morning. I tried to recreate that from when I first did this, but it, no, the magic's gone. The magic's gone, man. Steve got out of the way. I don't know how, how people can do a lot of this. Kind of I mean, that's how I tried with uh, one of some of my earlier videos that I've done. But. Yeah. And uh, this is me checking the recording to see the frame rate. So how you guys been doing? Well, this was quick. Uh, shoot everything as normal. Boy. Yeah, so I caught a 15 minute video until like a 4 minute video. Don't worry, chapter six is still gonna be be on here. Don't you worry. It's never gonna end, Steve. Oi. I don't know how long this is taking. Um this is the part where everything changes. And he just wanted a hug. So now you're seeing this part in Claire's point of view. I think when I was him, this whole thing happened as well, but... Let her go! This part I used a sound machine gun to be more nostalgic. And it, then you kill him. So pretty much this is... This is, uh... Claire's point of view on how she was attacked by Steve's father as a zombie. Here, I was actually telling you how next time I see you, it's gonna be at chapter six. So it's gonna be I'm gonna see you in one moment. Which, in fairness, I am going to see you in one moment. But I just wanted to make sure this commentary was sh showing what I wanted or telling you what I wanted to tell you. So, I will see you guys at chapter 6, and it's going to be live commentary as I'm playing it. So, I'll just see you in a, mo a moment. Hello everyone, I'm Jail Anderson 01 and welcome back to the last bonus video of Let's Play Resident Evil Dark Side Chronicles. Um, this is once again post-commentary because my little laptop is really stupid and that I didn't feel like I wanted to talk while playing the game because honestly I did so much better. It does, it kind of shows, but I'm not going to get into that right now. Must have come this way. Uh, as you clearly see, I am Claire and not Steve. And I was realizing it was obvious. I said, oh. So, 
Yeah, apparently during the chapter, Steve said a few different lines. If you uh, were Claire instead of him, like, gameplay wise, I like well, when they first crash you know, from the plane. He's a doll. This doesn't look like a tropical island. Let's go. I'm not 100% sure if he said that when you were him, but I just thought it was funny. Just some of his lines were slightly different. It was still pretty much like the same, but maybe a word or two different. Uh, but I am going. I did the Nosferatu boss fight again because Steve says like the greatest line ever that makes me laugh every time. And I'm like, oh, okay, Hunter. Although Claire and Steve never see the, the Hunter in their game when they're when you're playing with them. I hope so. I'm glad they included them because Chris is one who experiences the Hunters, but the Hunters and Code Veronica were, eh, they were difficult, I guess. I would say they were. attention was elsewhere because my attention span is like that of a squirrel and yes we've seen this it's just Steve says a really good fun line also when I played as Claire I didn't do very well in the Nosferatu fight so you actually see a couple of things that we never saw in my original gameplay you'll see Stuff that doesn't matter at this point. But you know, you get to see Steve on this side. For those who wanted to. A snowstorm. Yeah, I know it's Antarctica, it kinda happens. Snow. I love the snow effect on the face. I don't know if I that gameplay. That was like part 20? That was part 20 when this happened, when this boss fight happened. Let's go! Oy. Feels like a lifetime ago. Come on. I like how you actually hear those for Actor. Or Alexander Ashford, whoever you want to call him. He's both. Whee! This no! Way. I don't wanna. It's my best friend. There he is. Does he look lovely? Can he just mess up with him? What? Yeah. I really did not do well. This I was like, yeah, I can do this. I'm not gonna do this. Run. Run. It's gone. Nope, it's not. It's there. Hi. Also another reason why I'm doing post commentary is because I also have a sore throat. I have like a slight cold. I've been sneezing all day. You know I took allergy medicine. Oh my god! That scared me. Well done. Cell phone.
sorry about that. My friend in called me to discuss about bowling. But as you see, I was throwing bombs at, or grenades at him, and he picked Claire up. That's an attack he does. And you notice I also didn't do the quick time event. And that was, and this looks like the exorcist. It's freaking creepy. And then he flops like a reverse freaking regenerator. It's like creepy as all hell. I don't know. It just creeps me out. And yeah, I just crush him. Crush him like a bug. Yes. Uh, this is the best line ever. I'm gonna shut up. Blair, like the swing. Excuse me. Best line by Steve Burnside ever. That was like, I don't know, just it's funny. It's not funny to me right now because I just heard it when I played the game. But that was funny. Good job. Let's have some fun. Let's have some fun, Claire. <laughs> Steve wishes to get some fun with her. He, this, he does an attack here that I've never seen him do. See, he's using his freaking things like a boomerang. And I've never seen him do that when I played. I don't know, maybe because I delayed a couple of things. I don't know. I don't know what I did. I played the game the way I would play the game, and I and Claire is screaming because she does not like to swing. Claire does not like swinging, man. I thought I thought it was just a funny. Just it was just yeah, it was a funny. It was a funny. Like oh my gosh, she's down. This was a cheap thing. What happened at the end right here? We. This is what's so freaking cheap. Okay, see, I attack him. He hurts me, and then all of a sudden, the, the, yeah, the boss fight ends. He's like, I want the last hit, bitch. And he's like, you're about to die. Just gonna die. Yep, there we go. And it rains blood like it did when you were Steve. Or I don't know. I don't know who you people play. Hey, maybe you never played this game. You should go play it. It's actually fun. Once you get over Alexia being a cheap freaking boss. That's all I'm gonna say. Uh, so yeah, for for post commentary, I didn't do that much post commentary because I was distracted with a conversation with my mom and then a conversation with my friend. I should have a Wait, sign on my door go. that says "Do not disturb." Or something. And we're gonna watch the cutscene again. Just I just wanted to do it because I knew I was gonna do post commentary. Forgive me, so, I I could yeah, this is alone. the last episode ever of this of this series. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh no! Next, let's play project. Uh, I'm gonna start recording it around Thanksgiving and then finish recording slash posting during my Christmas break. And being in college, Christmas break is like a month long. I don't know why, but it is. And that Let's Play project I'm going to announce on Facebook, Tumblr, Twitter. I don't know, probably. Probably uh, by Sunday. Sunday sounds good. Yeah, it's, Alexia thinks it sounds good. Freaking cheap bitch. But, uh... The key's in it. Also, as of date, it's 9.20 right now. 9.18 was, uh... September 18th was my three-year anniversary of being on YouTube. And I'm gonna do it another year more. Just cause I can. Who's gonna stop me? My mom? Yeah, she would, actually. Should cut. Should be like you're stupid. She calls me stupid all the time for making YouTube videos. But it was a great hobby. Great hobby. Um. See, as you clear, my score looks freaking awesome already. It looks better than the last time. And I got an archive while in the middle of a. In the chapter it was where the boxes and the hunters were. And uh, I kind of go over it a little bit. Uh, Worker's Diary is the same one that you get from Code Veronica, and I accidentally switch. Yeah. And I'm like, I can't find it! 
But did I find it again? And did I notice something where, uh, the line says that he's a dick or something? Like, yeah. Right here. And I'm like, I don't remember seeing this in the original Code Veronica. But, with this being said, next Let's Play project is going to be posted about, uh, this coming up Sunday. This is being posted on 9-21-2013, so new Let's Play project will be announced on the 22nd. So until I, that announcement in the next video I make, have yourselves a zombie-free day.